What's up everybody, River here, welcome back bros to a brand new video on Bedrock Edition, I hope you guys are excited for today's episode. Today's episode, I'm going to be checking out 5 new PvP packs, if you haven't read the title already, but I'm sure you guys have. Anyway, without further ado, let's get right into it guys, let's press settings over here, go to global resources, my packs, and this is the first one right over here, we got the Plant Zoo 16x pack. Now this over here is actually a bit of a pink texture pack, so if you guys do like that colorway, be sure to go and check this out, because I haven't showed a pink pack in a minute, so be sure to go and actually take a look at it. And let me know if you guys would like to see more in this colorway. But without further ado, guys, let's actually go and press back on settings. And as you can see, this is what the main menu looks like. And then when we go and actually press play, as you can see, once again, the menu is looking fire. But let's actually go and drop right into it. And as you ladies and gentlemen can see, this is actually over here for the inventory. We actually have the Plant 2 logo right over there, guys. And we got ourselves a bit of a pot in the corner. And as you can see, it's like super minimalistic, which I definitely do like. So yeah, hope you bros like that as well. And then once we head over here, as you can see, the golden apples basically look like strawberries, like pink strawberries. Let me know what you think, except for obviously like the normal apple. That is just normal. But the golden one and the enchanted golden one are actually custom in over there. Anyway, without further ado, hope you bros actually do like basically all the food and even the wood in this pack as well too is actually pink as well like the creator definitely went all out with the details it is actually crazy and as you can see a lot of stuff on over here has actually been switched to pink guys and for the pvp items like the diamond stuff actually purple so be sure to go and actually take a look at them and the ender pro looks super cool as well too as you can see we got the pink bow the fishing rod and we got ourselves the rest of these swords over there which are actually all short swords as always looking super insane but take a look at the potions as you guys can see the potions actually look super Super cool as well too like it literally looks like a drink like what i've actually never seen that before so let me know what you think about that but overall this actually looks super cool if you do like the pink colorway so be sure to go and actually take a look at that but anyway let's actually go and head outside and as you can see we actually have the clear water right up over there looking super awesome and we have outlines on basically all of the ores which i think actually looks super amazing as you guys can see we got some pastel looking colorways in over here in the texture pack but anyway let's actually go and get right into the sword we got the sword over here we got the insane custom inventory with once again the strawberries and everything looking amazing we got the enchanted apple over here let's eat that up we got the bow over here as well too as you can see we got ourselves like a bit of a heart projectile particle so be sure to go and take a look at that we got the fishing rod as well too up and over here the flint and steel as you can see we got a bit of a low fire and a light pink colorway on that we got ourselves the ender pearl which looks super sick as well and without further ado let's go and take a look at the block breaking animation and this is what it looks like as you guys can and see for white wool and it's basically going to be the exact same thing for everything but anyway guys we're going to go and get into the armor in a second let's actually go and take a look at the health potion though and that actually looks pretty far as you guys can see let me go and actually spawn in a villager though and this over here is the pvp crit in there as you can see that actually looks pretty far we got ourselves actually some pretty insane heart icons and then right over here to wrap it up we got ourselves the diamond armor and once again it looks pretty cool just really unique because we actually have ourselves a headband instead of like a normal minecraft helmet so let me know what you actually do think about this but overall this is definitely an insane pack guys and yeah the creator definitely did a 10 out of 10 job on it but let's actually go and head outside and show you guys the outside sky so this is actually over here looks like a apple when we look at the sun and then yeah basically it goes color and then once we're not looking at the sun everything goes black and white and then if we go to nighttime this is what it looks like at nighttime as you guys can see basically the exact same sky but it's actually a bit of a darkish blue colorway now anyway bros that's about to wrap it up for for this one let's check out the next pack Anyway, bros, next up, let's go and take a look at the Ranked Bed Wars 16X pack over here. Let's actually go and activate it, and once again, this is another 16X pack, but we can actually go and press the gear icon on this one over here, and you guys can actually go and change it if you want, and over here for, like, the Night Sky plus Hit Particle, we got the Day Sky plus Hit Particle, and obviously some more options for Night Sky and Day Sky, but no Particles as well, so be sure to go and take a look at that, bros, but without further ado, I'm just gonna go and keep our Night Sky plus Hit Particle, and let's actually press back on settings, and yo, we got this pretty fire menu screen as you can see we got the map black buttons in over here i'm really liking that and yo this is actually a really nice pack just so far looking at a bit of the features but oh my goodness we're now over here in game and take a look at this this actually might be my new favorite pack drop a like in this video if you guys are actually enjoying it so far and also just before i do continue in the video guys don't forget i'm doing an iphone giveaway at 100k subscribers so be sure to subscribe and share the channel up with your friends and fam but 
uh, anyway, let me go, let me go jam that drawer. All right, that was actually a bit loud, but anyway, guys, this is actually the pack over here once again. I hope you like it. Like, this pack is heat, boys, and then without further ado, on this side over here, we got ourselves the golden apples and everything. Once again, looking amazing. We got the rest of the food over here. Without further ado, this side over here is actually pretty good. Is a wild suit, as you can see. We got ourselves all of these swords over there with actually flat tops. But yeah, as you bros can see, the colorways on these are just looking super amazing, and I feel like that definitely makes the pack. As you can see, it's just like a really nice like contrast and like vibrance to this pack that just makes it look amazing. So I hope you actually do like it. But without further ado, let's actually go and head outside. And sadly, there is actually no clear water in this one. However, there is actually outlines in the ores, which I really, really do like, guys. Once again, you know, keep it in minimalistic and pretty basic, but I do like that. All right, we got the sword in hand. We got ourselves the custom inventory with the golden apples in there. That's awesome. Let's go and take a look at the enchanted apple, though. That is it over there. We got ourselves the boat is a wild too. As you guys can see, looking amazing over here. We got the fishing rod is a wild too. Nice, nice, nice. And then we got ourselves the low fire over here, which is actually looking super amazing. And it's got the rotating animation to actually save you guys some FPS. So be sure to go and take a look at that. And then we got the ender pearl as well too. And that's what it looks like. Once again, amazing ender pearl. We got ourselves the white wool over here. That's what the block breaking animation looks like. Pretty basic in there. But anyway, we got the instant health over there next. Oh, yo, that's actually amazing. But without further ado, let's actually go and check out the armor. And as you can see, the armor in this pack X looks amazing. Once again, we got ourselves this really sick blue armor over here for obviously the diamond armor. And the rest of the sets actually look really good as well too. So be sure to go and definitely take a look at this. But without further ado, let's actually go and head outside and check out the skies. And this is actually the daytime sky. Yo, that's actually crazy. But you guys can actually go and pick once again in the main menu if you want daytime sky 24-7 or nighttime sky. So this is technically the day sky, but it's also technically the night sky. Anyway, without further ado, it basically just gets a bit darker, guys, at nighttime. And that's actually about to go and wrap it up. Let's actually go and check out the next pack, though. Alright, without further ado, next up we're about to go and take a look at the Root Beer 16x pack over here, guys. So without further ado, let's actually go and activate it. But I'm actually really excited to take a look at this as well, too, because it's firstly got a gear icon. Once again, you guys are now the nighttime and the daytime sky. You can go and choose all that in over there. But we're gonna go with the nighttime sky plus a particle. But yeah, the main reason I want to go and check this pack out is because I heard it is actually the best new blue pack, boys, for 16x. So we're about to go and actually see. Let's actually go and press back on settings, and this is actually it. But yeah, bros, the menu screen actually does look to be kind of similar to the last one but anyway let's actually go and press play over here guys and let's go and get right into it Anyway, bros, this is the inventory. As you can see, once again, looking straight up heated over here. You already know the vibes, but yeah, that looks really awesome. Even like the items like in over there for the armor pieces look really good. But okay, let's actually go and get right into it, guys. We got the apples over here, which I really like. They're actually small apples. Nice, nice, nice. I really like this red apple in there, though. It looks really basic, but honestly, it looks really nice. So let me know what you think. But yeah, the apples in here are actually looking really good. All right, we got ourselves basically the food over there, though. And then on this side, over here we got ourselves these swords and everything which actually looks super super cool guys and then over here we got ourselves the weapons and tools as always and over there the ender pearl that's the 10 out of 10 ender pearl i gotta give it to them this is actually a really nice blue pack we got ourselves the bow the fishing rod etc in over there boys and even a blue cap on the empty bottle nice all right let's actually get outside though and sadly yo the first l of this pack guys we have no clear water and there's no outlines on the oars however i still do think they look super cool so let me know what you think about them but uh, yeah, dude, that's actually like still really awesome. All right, we got the whole entire inventory though. The inventory, gotta give them a 10 out of 10 on this one. As you can see, the hearts and the hunger bar look super awesome. And even the sword in our hands, yo, that is awesome, guys. All right, let's actually go and take a look at the enchanted apple. Let's go and eat that up over there. You already know. We got ourselves the boat over here. That's what it looks like. We got a bit of like a black and blue particle in there, guys. Bit of a projectile one for the boat in there. We got ourselves the fishing rod, as you can see. We got the flint and steel, which I is low fire with the rotating animation nice 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 we got the ender pearl over there is a well the white well let's go and take a look at the block breaking animation that's what it looks like we got ourselves the instant health splash effect in over there not bad i think that's actually the basic one though and without further ado let's actually go and take a look at the villager and yo that was actually heat okay i need to go and do that one more time guys because that was just amazing but yo look at that that is actually sick i hope your boys do like it all right we're gonna go and actually wrap it up over here though 
with the armor and this is what the armor does gonna look like it looks like i don't know about you guys but it really looks like the diamond item to me so let me know i feel like we're like literally wearing full of diamonds though like this over here personally i think is better even than the minecraft texture like the normal minecraft texture mojang like you guys need to go ahead and literally step up your game and use this pack because this over here looks like how i feel like diamond armor like literally should look like like it actually looks like a diamond but anyway let's actually go and get right out of here but that is actually awesome guys all right enchanted diamond looks fire though on your boy all right let's actually go outside though and this is what the background does go and look like so we did pick the night sky once again so that is it and then basically same as last pack nighttime actually makes it a bit darker but anyway guys let's actually go check out the next pack all right, bros, next up, we're going to go and take a look at the Azura 69X pack over here. So this one over here actually looks really new as well, guys. It's actually basically just been ported as well. So I'm actually really excited to go ahead and take a look at this. But yeah, if we press the gear icon, as you can see, we got the nighttime sky and the daytime. You already know we're going with nighttime, though. Nighttime is like literally the best skies, at least like 99% of the time. But let's press back on settings. And this is what it looks like. As you guys can see, we got this insane menu screen over here. As you can see, I think it looks really, really awesome. And as you can see, we even have ourselves like basically like a showcase already of like the armor and everything in the background all right let's take the home press play though guys and let's take the home drop right into this though all right, we're actually now in game. This is what the inventory does go look like. I hope you bros actually do like it over here. Pretty awesome. And then once we do go and actually take a look over here, this is actually what the golden apples do go and look like. I would say they're actually like decent. Not my favorite golden apples, but they're decent, guys. And then over here, we got ourselves the rest of the food. And then this side over here, as you can see, we actually have these swords, which actually look really good. I'm actually really loving the diamonds on this one, personally. Let me know what you think. We got ourselves a bit of like a cool mint colorway in over there. And then we got ourselves the ender pearl over here as well, too, and the rest the items which actually look really awesome like that bow over there is sick fishing rod is epic we got ourselves the flint and steel which i really like as well and then at the bottom we got ourselves basically the potions guys but anyway let's actually go and get outside and as you can see we got clear water as well too we got outlines on yes we got outlines on every single ore this is actually really really good you already know guys this pack is gonna be epic and then we got ourselves the sword and hands we got ourselves the enchanted apple let's take a look at the bow over here so this is what the bow actually does go ahead and look like pretty good as well too not bad not bad guys and then we got ourselves the fishing rod as well and over there we got the flint and steel which is actually oh super saturated and we got ourselves basically low fire on it as well guys we got ourselves the ender pearl that's what it looks like the white wool block breaking animation over there guys the instant health too yo and then without further ado let's go and take a look at the particles i'm actually really excited though so apparently it looks like yo it actually looks like a cool mint in over there that's actually pretty sick just as i expected and then over here here we actually do have ourselves basically the armor which once again looks really really awesome guys but anyway that's actually about to go and wrap it up for this one guys let's actually go and head outside though to show y'all these skies though and this is what these skies do look like so it's actually pretty basic but you know what i'm saying it is a bit of a custom sky and i'm definitely here for it. so this is actually daytime and this over here is actually nighttime so basically it just gets a bit dimmer but anyway guys that is gonna go and wrap it up for this one let's get into the final pack though for this video, aka the Olive 256X pack. So I had to go and actually save the 256X pack for the number one spot. Just because like the rest of them are all 16X. And like this one over here is obviously a lot better. If you're talking resolution, boy. So let's actually go and press activate over here. Um, but yeah, I'm actually really excited to go and take a look at it. I've actually never checked out an Olive pack in like all of the days of my reviewing on this channel. And as you can see, we got the night sky slash day sky resolution in over here as well. But we're going to go and actually keep it on night sky over here. And let's let's actually press back on settings and see oh okay we got ourselves actually a bit of a olive colorway over here let me know what you're thinking but this is actually super sick all right let's actually go and press play though guys and let's actually go and drop right into this though all right, bro. So this is what the inventory does go and look like. As you can see, once again, pretty basic over here. Once again, with PvP packs nowadays, but it's actually pretty cool. Once again, we actually do have ourselves just like a whole entire clear inventory. But take a look at that armor, jeez, guys. But over here, ladies and gentlemen, as you can see, we got the golden apples and everything, looking super, super amazing. Holy guys, those are actually super crazy. I don't even know what to say. I'm speechless for this pack, low key right now. And then as you can see, we got ourselves basically all of the food over here. And look at the mushrooms 
mushroom soup. It's like literally now olive soup, guys. Like, that's actually pretty crazy. So, yeah, be sure to go ahead and definitely take a look at all of this. But let's actually go and head around over to this side. And this side over here is where we get into the goodness. We got the weapons over there, guys. We got ourselves the olive green sword. We got ourselves all of the tools and everything as well. We got ourselves the ender pearl, which is like literally flawless. I'm really liking that. We got the bow over here. We got ourselves the fishing rod, you know, flint and steel, all that jazz. But let's actually go and get out, guys. And as you can see, we do have ourselves the clear water. We got outlines on all of the ores. And yo, the ores look really, really nice, guys. And it's actually not really like a 256x edit as well for them. I feel like that's, I feel like maybe like a 32x edit or something. But yeah, that is sick over there. And then take a look at the diamonds as well. The olive green diamonds. Those are amazing, yo. I'm liking this pack. I'm liking this pack. We got the custom green hearts XP, as you can see. We got the sword in hands. We got ourselves the enchanted apple, guys. Yo, that's actually awesome. As you can see, we got the clear water. Let's shoot right through it, though. And boom. This is what it does go and actually look like, as you can see. We got the fishing rod as well. Tune over there. We got the flint and steel over here. As you can see, that's what it looks like. And I like how they actually didn't really make, like, everything in this pack a 256x edit. Like, they actually left this pretty normal. And, yeah, that's actually a pretty nice low fire over there. Let me know what you do think. The pixels on it are just, like, amazing. Anyway, bros, let's actually go with the ender pearl next. And that's what it does go look like. Once again, flawless, guys. All right, we got the wool over here. Let's go and take a look at the block breaking animation. Pretty custom, actually. We got the instant health over there. Pretty custom as well, too. I do like that. Let's take a look at this. Is this good? Oh my gosh, no way. That is actually amazing. Okay, so we got ourselves actually some olive and black like stars in over there. What? Yo, that is awesome. Then take a look at the armor over here as well, too. As you can see, guys, just straight up heat once again. So be sure to go ahead and drop a like in this video, guys, because I am showing y'all the best new PvP packs, guys, every single week. Yo, that's awesome. All right, let's actually head outside, though. And this over here is the sky. So I gotta be honest with you guys. I'm gonna say it right now. This is the most detailed sky I have ever seen or probably ever showed on one of my videos. Like, just like, this is so clear. Like, it's like, I'm looking at like a 4K screen or something and my, my monitor isn't even 4K, but it looks 4K. Like, it's crazy. So be sure to go and take a look at it. It just looks really good. And yeah, that's actually about to go and wrap it up. But holy guys. Okay, so that is actually the daytime sky over there once again with like this crazy green galaxy. And then nighttime is basically the exact same thing but obviously dimmed down a bit anyway thank you so much for watching guys like home and stuff for more i'll catch you in my next one peace out everybody